in one of my recent uh, projects in Miami, uh, I took a YouTuber with me to film it, and uh, in one moment he looked me at the, uh, very deeply and said, uh, "You should have been a YouTuber." Okay, let's say, uh, let's see if it's uh, true. I'm going to show you my show, my retrospective show in Malaga, in Ars Malaga Museum, and the show is uh, basically is. Uh, shows three different blocks of work. The first block is my studio. My studio as a place to experiment with sculpture and try to give to each piece the quality of uh, a multi-lateral uh, sculpture and uh, mixing uh, materials and so on. Each of the sculptures are also devoted to a particular project. There are uh, sculptures to this Madrid project of uh, the uh, Mercado de la Vide. There are uh, sculptures about the facades in Havana, in Miami. Uh, that's a facade in, in Chicago. That's a piece of the Bethlehem Kirche, the first model. And here I uh, took with me also a project uh, of uh, the Manquita de Malaga. The tower that never that was never built, so it's a memory to things that never existed. It's a sculpture that uh, is planned for the city of Malaga to be placed facing the cathedral with a perspective. There is also uh, some pieces, uh, smaller pieces of uh, uh, the old London Bridge, uh, and here there is a pattern. This is the way we work at the studio. I hate to throw garbage. So uh, the only garbage that will one day go out of the studio is me when, I'm, uh, when, when I will be made ash. Other than that, I try to put uh, all of the uh, materials uh, uh, such in a way that finish by being work. Let's see the second uh, room. The second room is uh, actually is a full project. Is a a uh, project called Memoria del Giardino. This project was done for the 55th uh, Biennial in uh, uh, Venice, curated by Barbara Rose, and recovers the symmetry that existed in uh, the garden, uh, in, in the first botanical garden in Europe. So it's uh, composed by 10 uh, tombstones, gravestones, that um, uh, have messages of the three uh, geniuses that used to live uh, in that garden, which are Ezra Pound, uh, which are uh, Amadeo Modigliani and Mariano Fortuny. Uh, when it was there in the Venice Biennial, all of these pieces came out of the bushes and, uh, uh, because it was uh, really like a selma. And uh, some of the sentences are really strong. Then, the third room basically uh, has some of the works that I have considered strategical for my, from my point of view, big jumps for me, producing sculpture, mixing materials, or the sort of experiments. Uh, and, uh, well, this is a facade. Uh, uh, also from uh, Havana, there is uh, this uh, La Tour de l'Horloge, uh, Tower of the Clock in, in Paris, that's uh, Vase de Tuyari in Paris too, and this is a Cheval de Marly, the, uh, uh, from, from, it's a fragment, those, is, those are fragments of pieces. And this is another uh, example of the way we produce sketches now. This is a drawing on um, fabric, and uh, I introduced the element in very big, big size. We like to work on the street, and when, when you work on the street, you are welding there with all of your mask and everything. You need big format material to, 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 to be sure that you are doing properly what you have to do and following the plans. And this is uh, actually a sketch. And this is a sketch for the installation in the fourth room, which is also a project. This is the uh, Leptis Magna recovery. That was the drawing, that is the project. It's the recovery of the, uh, these elements that go out of the 
uh, bases uh, uh, of this city that is nowadays in Libya. Uh, in this project, in, 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 in this project uh, in the museum, this, this is uh, a retrospective show, and uh, even though uh, we know very well what uh, my, my works are, uh, we took a lot of risks, we experimented a lot, and that's only possible because of a very big and uh, expert team. Uh, an artist alone can do nothing. He needs around lots of people that uh, devote his life to uh, art too, and without them it would be completely impossible. Thank you very much.